What's going on, everyone? Another great Monday in the books. Super productive. Hope it was productive for everyone who end up, ends up watching this video. Monday's kind of my, my favorite day, and uh, I know that I said that Friday was my favorite day in the last video, and it's true. Every day is my favorite day, as, uh, as corny as that sounds. I think that means that I just really love what I do and love who I work with, and I've said it before in these videos, but I don't feel like I've worked really in years, and I really think that's the truth. And coming from a job where, not that it was a bad job before, but that the HVAC job that I had before this, um, you know, I, I can I can tell you the difference between feeling like you have a job and feeling like you get to wake up and do what you love with, you know, people that you love and admire and respect every single day, and it's night and day different, and if, uh, if you're in that position, do everything you possibly can to, to get out, bet on yourself um, smartly. But um, there's, there's, there's a light at the end of the tunnel, essentially. I don't know where that came from. This post wasn't really supposed to be about that at all. Um, this post was, I got a message the other day uh, from a guy looking to get into real estate. I really appreciate him reaching out. I think it's super cool. I'm not an expert by any means or imagination and um, but I am active in this space and will probably uh, happily give my, give my opinion if, uh, if asked upon, if I think I can help. And the, the comment was kind of implying that how are you one person doing all of this? And I, I realize that's something that, you know, I talk about a lot, but I don't really go into a lot of depth on is, you know, the rapid growth that our company is experiencing is because of us, like it's not me. You know, we're, there's 10 of us in the office, including myself, and and another probably six to 12 guys at all times working on our houses um, that is, you know, full-time employed by, by our company. Like we are becoming, you know, a company of 20 plus people um, on a regular basis. Um, it's certainly not, not me. Like this is not me out here doing this. Um, it is a team sport and everyone is stepping up. Everyone is adding value. Everyone is almost trying to outdo each other every single day um, and provide more value than the next person. No one leaves at five. Like everyone like everyone doesn't stop until it's done. And that environment is, um, it's addicting. And I think we all, we all are addicted um, to the growth that we're experiencing, to the team that we're building and to the culture that this company is, is developing. But, and I, I know I talk about this, this a lot, um, but I, like, I'm good at a few things. Um, I'm good at financing. I really love creative financing. Like, in fact, I think that's probably my, my niche if I had to pick one thing. I love raising investor money. I don't mind putting myself out there. These videos are still really uncomfortable, posting on Facebook and telling everyone what we're doing and basically living in this glass house where everyone can see what, like see me. Like I don't, in, I don't really enjoy it, but I'll do it. Um, it does feel heavy to me where like creative financing feels super light. Like I, I can sit down and like get on Excel all day, um, never talk to anybody and just be a huge introvert and love every second of it. Uh, but you know, this is just part of the, the, I guess the value that, that I'm willing to do. There's, there's other aspects of this business that I am terrible at. Um, like I'm doing my first renovation in two years, um, on my, my personal house and it, it's going well. Like I've, I've done a lot of renovations before, but compared to my partners, um, uh, compared to Devin Hogue, our project manager, compared to Sam Singraff, like I am terrible. Like I'm not even the same league as they are in terms of like how to conduct a, to conduct a renovation. Um, when it comes to like building systems and like hiring, I, I can't even light a candle to what Ryan Mars can do. Um, and that's just, that's just to name three people within our, within our organization. So I, th I think it's really important to note that, you know, the fastest way for rapid growth is to ra surround yourself with people where something that feels really heavy for you feels super light for them. Um, like something that you would procrastinate a week, like they love doing and fills them up every, every single day. And that's, that's, I feel like what we've, what we've done. We're all again, trying to provide a ton of value. We all have our kind of certain little, uh, neat, uh, niche that we all gravitate towards and like doing. And, um, that that's what's leading to all this. It's not one person. 
uh, by any stretch of the, uh, the imagination. I just happened to be the person that was like, when we were sitting around a table, like, all right, who's gonna put themselves out on Facebook to start telling people what we're doing? It was like, all right, you, um, type situation. <laughs> like, I, was, I guess I just drew the short, uh, the short stick, but it's certainly not, uh, not just me. So uh, again, appreciate everybody who reaches out. Um, we're scaling up, we're building an awesome team. And I realized the other day that the last four people we've hired have come from people who have watched these videos, have reached out, we've grabbed coffee, and somehow that's transitioned into, hey, if you ever left your job, I'd love for you to join the team. And then transitioned very shortly into, hey, yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do that. I wanna be a part of this environment and this team that you guys are building and being on the, on the ground floor while it's still semi-small. Um, so if you're interested at all in leaving the W-2, taking a chance on yourself, being a part of a rapid, high-paced environment, um, and being surrounded with guys that, you know, and like a team that just isn't gonna stop until we're the absolute very best, then you absolutely need to need to reach out. I'd love to grab coffee and see how we might be able to, be able to work together, whether that's me just steering you in direction and maybe buying some houses from you as a wholesaler, whether that's um, me selling you houses or whatever, something something to do with real estate, we'll end up doing together. And uh, it, hopefully, you know, it'll be a win-win for uh, both of us. And if it's not, we just, we won't do it. But from what I've seen, like the power of just sitting down and having coffee for 30 minutes has led into some awesome relationships. Um, like just, just, uh, it, it's just, just the power of one, one Facebook message. Um, can lead to, you know, changing the rest of your life. So thanks everybody for watching. Um, I'll be probably back on Wednesday with another live video. Again, doing Monday, Wednesday, Friday. Um, probably making some more Facebook posts in between. I'm trying to get a lot more active on uh, on Instagram, which means just more posts. Again, it feels kind of super uncomfortable to put ourselves out there in a way that I haven't before, but uh, just gonna just going to keep doing it. And uh, again, if you're interested in real estate, reach out. I'd love to connect. And uh, hopefully we can do some deals together. All right. See you guys soon.